welcome to Las Vegas. I know people have many different opinions about Las Vegas, but you know why I think it is the perfect place to vacation, because I don't care where you're from, Las Vegas is the opposite of it. <laughs> Isn't it true? Because yeah. gambling's legal, prostitution's legal. Guess the jails here are just full of people who litter. We have beauty and wonder right around the corner, the Grand Canyon. I went last year, but I didn't do the helicopter. No, I wasn't afraid of the helicopter. It's just that before you get in one, you have to tell your weight. I looked around and thought, well, if everyone is lying like I'm lying, we're going down. <laughs> and of course, we have the theme hotels. The Venetian, that's one of my favorites. It's kind of an interesting meeting of old world meets new. I, I never really thought I'd be able to take a gondola to the Gap. <laughs> and I don't know if you've noticed, Vegas is becoming classier. <laughs> oh dear, <laughs> it appears you haven't noticed. <laughs> Can I tell you something that might just change your minds? We have a ballet company now. Thank you, yes, it's topless, but it's a ballet company. Everything must be topless in Vegas, it's the law. We have a topless female magician, she's very good. She says, now you see it, now you see the other one. In the summer, now we have topless sunbathing by the pools. Ooh, I would never do that. Things cross my mind like they've never been in the sun, they might catch fire. My husband says he won't allow me to go topless. He says he's afraid I might poke someone's knee out. <laughs> oh, it's not that funny. It's just not. And it gets so hot here in the summer. It really does, but it doesn't bother people. Hottest day of the year, this woman, she's out there sunbathing by the pool. I could tell she was done. Well, her belly button had popped up. Yes. You get wacky tans, you don't even know what's happening. I was walking around, I had on a long sleeve blouse and long trousers and just my face got really, really red. And I came home that night and I took off my clothes and I looked like a match. <laughs> you know what I like though? I like those spray on tans, have you seen them? Yeah. They're so easy, I use them on turkey. because you're not supposed to go in the sun. I've read about it. Oh, it's so bad for you. It's supposed to make your skin leathery and wrinkly and old. Sometimes I look at those gorgeous 16-year-old girls just, just baking themselves on the beach and think, fry, you homewreckers, fry! <laughs> because women, don't we hate getting older? Yeah. Oh, men, you're gonna learn so much about women tonight. I'm so excited. <laughs> we will do anything to stop those wrinkles. Oh, my Aunt Sylvia just had herself laminated. <laughs> I just bought a new wrinkle cream. Use it once a day, you look younger in a month, and twice a day, you look younger in two weeks. I ate it. <laughs> I got those silicone cheek implants, but you know what happened? They slipped, and now I just have really white feet. My Aunt Sylvia, she got the latest operation. Wait till you hear, she got a hand lift. Have you heard of that? It is a real operation. They take the wrinkles out of your hand. She's 72, she can't wave anymore, but she can still high five. <laughs> and next week she's getting an eye lift, a neck lift, and a knee lift. Her surgeon's having a special all you can lift. <laughs> We do terrible things to ourselves to stay young looking. Do you know about Botox? Do you know what it is? Do you know that it's botulism, which I've made in my kitchen quite a few times? <laughs> and the doctors inject the poisonous bacteria into our faces and it paralyzes us. And we love that. <laughs> my aunt had her forehead paralyzed. She can't frown anymore. And it has side effects. Now if she disapproves of something, she has to spit. <laughs> My best friend got a face of this year. Oh, they made her too tight. It doesn't look right. She chews and her eyebrows go up and down. 
And she lifts her chin and her toes fly up. <laughs> we were living in LA. Everyone gets something done in LA. Oh yes, we were rear-ended in our car by a woman who was woozy because she just had her lips blown up with collagen. Well, that was lucky because her airbag didn't deploy and they saved her life. <laughs> Okay, here's one of the worst things about getting older. The mean cards people send you on your birthday. Aren't those cards mean? And the closer the people are to you, the meaner the card. I got a birthday card this year. It had a picture of a rotting corpse on the front. And I opened it up and it said, at least she can still attract flies. Love your mother.